All right, we got a couple of Sarkist uh, brand pouches here of either tuna or yellowfin. Now, uh, yellowfin is a, a better type of tuna because uh, this in terms of the mercury content is a lot smaller. They're smaller fish as well. So as you can see here from the back, uh, these are all the information and ingredients. It doesn't specify though, this is the one issue with this type of packet. It doesn't specify here where the fish is caught. Usually it is specified. For example, if you go here, it says product of Ecuador. This is the same brand and company uh, for these pouches. So if you go over here, product of Thailand. So, you know, for tuna, uh, tuna can be caught in many different places around the world. So you just want to keep, keep in mind and keep track of where it is caught. Now, Ecuador, Ecuador, I've, I've heard that uh, tuna from there is pretty good. It's not bad. Uh, Thailand, you're going to get uh, certain types of pollutants in the water, which the tuna might be able to uh, digest and eat, uh, especially maybe radiated fish from Fukushima coming from there. Um, this is unfortunate that the company doesn't even post it for this. I wonder why though, maybe it's a marketing tactic. I'm presuming it's a marketing because maybe they don't want to put down as, you know, China or, or something, or I don't know, specifics in terms of that. But uh, this is a better type of tuna if you want to be able to digest it and eat it uh, in comparison to this regular tuna. Um, let's go ahead and check, compare the, uh, you know, the, this is the ingredients and pouch. So as you can see here, I mean, this is uh, talking about double. Uh, this is almost more than double the calories for the EVOO, uh, Starcast Select. And in terms of total fat is 12 grams, saturated fat. Is this higher in terms of all the bad stuff, uh, which is surprising. You even got monosaturated fat, which is better than polysaturated, but you got two grams of polysaturated fat. Um, the, one, the regular tuna does this have only 0.5 grams. Uh, protein content, you're getting about the same. Uh, 17 grams on the left, 18 grams on the right. Sodium content, you get a lot higher sodium, a lot more salt and the lemon pepper. Um, let's take a look at the ingredients. Uh, this one has, let me see, light tuna, water, following sugar, vegetable broth, you know, they put sugar in them, you know, everything in now is added sugar. Um, and then yellowfin tuna, extra olive oil, and salt. So three ingredients in one and about five or six in the other one. Uh, does it need five or six in this one? Probably not. Let's take a look at this other one. This is a uh, rice and beans. So let's take a look at this one. Very low protein count. So they're putting less tuna on this one and putting more rice and beans. So you can see seven grams of only protein, 110 calories, uh, let's say mono, polysaturated, one gram, monosaturated 0.5 gram, not that much. Sodium is higher than all three packages. You're about 425 milligrams of sodium in this one little small packet. This is a very small packet here. Very high amount of salt. Uh, total grams of sugar, one gram of sugar. Let's take a look at the uh, ingredient list. You got the rice. Brown rice, black barley. Looks like they got a bunch of different things in there. Bean blend. Uh, got xanthan gum. Uh, natural flavors, which is never a good thing. Potassium chloride. Yeah, it's not the it's not the healthiest. The best one is probably this one in terms of the ingredient list. And uh, the problem with that is that this there's a lot of salt, a lot of salt in this one, and. Uh, surprisingly, this, uh, you know, polysaturated, monosaturated fats, it doesn't even specify uh, the origin of this yellowfin tuna, which is terrible. Um, like I said, it might be a marketing tactic in terms of that. But yeah, if you can see here, they're all 2.6 ounces of net weight. This is a little higher, it's 3 ounces because you've got rice and beans that's added to it. So, um, that's the only difference. But anyways, guys, that's just a quick review of these tunas. Uh, you want to be able to keep this in mind when purchasing tuna um, that not all tuna is the same 
and uh, not all the ingredients are gonna be the same. So, hope this is helpful. Uh, press the like button, subscribe for more videos. If you haven't, check out the other videos on my channel. Thank you.